morning. And uh, you know, we see so many home security cameras these days. So many of them are kind of the same, and they have the same difficulties. They detect motion when the wind blows, the curtains tell us that there's an intruder when the dog runs to the living room, which we don't necessarily need to know about. Lighthouse promises to be a different kind of security camera, so I took the lighthouse for a test. The first thing you'll notice about the lighthouse is the shape. It's pretty unique, and you can see why they call it the lighthouse. It can spin on the base, so you can point it in different directions in the room. First and foremost, it's a home security camera. Use the app to look in on your home when you can't be there. The difference between the lighthouse and other home security cameras is those squiggly lines around my body. You see that right here. So that's not just detecting motion. It's actually detecting a 3D object. If you take a look at the front of the lighthouse, you have a camera on the bottom, and a 3D sensor on the top along with infrared lights. Now all of this combined, again, detects 3D objects instead of just movement, hopefully preventing false alarms and better detecting people and pets. So the Lighthouse uses that 3D technology to detect people and faces. And after you start identifying those faces in the app, the Lighthouse can start to automatically recognize who is in the room, sending you a notification if it detects a person, for example, who you haven't identified. It can also identify Identify pets. It knows when motion isn't an actual person, maybe a curtain in the breeze, and doesn't notify you of that. You can even ask questions in the app, like what did the dog do while I was gone, or did you see anyone new with the kids today, or even tell me when you see a certain person. It's a home security camera with 3D vision and a brain, promising not only smarter detection, but a more human-like interaction in the app. And you guys know I've actually tested a lot of these home security cameras because so many people are interested in them right now. This is easily the smartest home security camera I've ever tested. I love the artificial intelligence side of it. The 3D camera does make a big difference in determining objects versus people and pets. But it does come with a much larger size. You see how big this thing is. I brought in two other cameras. This is the WISE and the, the Logi, Logi Circle. Much smaller, uh, Nest camera smaller as well. So you get that technology, but you pay for it when it comes to size. Uh, it's also expensive, $300 for the Lighthouse camera, G give you uh, three months of uh, AI service, but after that it's going to cost you $10 a month. You can use it without that monthly fee, but you're not going to get all that artificial intelligence stuff that's mm. kind of baked into it. And they give you, they store videos in the cloud longer if you pay for the service fee. I wish it was 5 bucks a month. T 10 bucks a month is a lot of money. Yeah, no kidding. So I've got my full review. If you're interested, if, if you're willing to pay for it, it is the smartest camera out there. Go to KDVR.com, click on the On TV tab at the top of our page to read my full review. More pictures, links to where you buy, can buy it, et cetera, et cetera. All right, good stuff. Well, all morning.